Why should people come and see this show? I think there are lots of reasons why people should come and see this show. For me, personally, I love theatre. I grew up in the theatre, my dad used to perform, and there's something about being in this space. Well, see, right now, you see how empty it is and how quiet it is. You would never know that this room is full of laughter and magic and music and noise. And I love the fact that it can go from being where it is now to being one of the best places to sit when you want to watch a show. More importantly for me, it's the best place, certainly these days, where a whole family can watch the same thing and enjoy it the same as each other. Because we don't spend time with our families that much, do we? Mum and Dad sort of do their own thing, we sort of do our own thing at school. And there's not many places you can go where you can enjoy something as a family. And theatre for me is all about that. When you come here, you're going to laugh. You're going to get a little bit wet because I've got a water pistol. But you're also going to have a great time. You're going to get into the Christmas spirit. And you're going to go out of here singing and dancing after having a great time. That's what theatre is all about for me. Who inspired me to be an actress? So, no one in particular actually, but I've always loved musicals and I've always been to see theatre from being a little, a little kid. Um, and I always liked playing a character. And as funny as it is being myself, I actually prefer playing somebody else. So that's kind of why I wanted to be an actress. My favourite character in this show is Models. And the reason he's my favourite character is because he kind of ties everything together. He's, he's the reason theatre is a good thing to go and see, because you don't get the chance to see somebody that funny on telly. Nobody gets that amount of time. When you come into a theatre, I think Muddles has a very important role, and that is to make the audience feel a part of the show, but also to tell the story as well. It's a very difficult thing to do. And to be funny while you're doing all that is actually a very, very hard thing to do, and I think he does it better than anybody I've worked with, so I would say Muddles for sure. He's also stood right there and gave me £20 to say that. He didn't. So what was the, um, would you prefer to be you in real life now or models and why? Ooh. Um, I think me, because uh, I quite like stuff I do. It's a lot of fun. Cool. And I, yeah, well, well, I mean, that goes without saying. But um, I think I'd prefer to be me because uh, I like my family and I like where I live and all those things. But I do envy Muddle's ability to get away with pretty much being an absolute dafty all the time and no one ever pulling him up on it. Because even his mum, his mum's the only one who tells him off for being daft. But she's just as daft. That's kind of a brilliant world to live in, isn't it? If everybody was just being a little bit daft and nobody minded. So um, if, I could, if I could bring a bit of muddles into my life, that would be a happy balance, I think. And those overalls are really comfy, so that's a win-win. The reason why I think everybody should come and see this show is because it's full of fun, magic, and we're all about having a laugh here. And it gets us in the Christmas spirit as well, not just us as a cast and company, but everybody in the audience as well. Why, would, why do you want people to come watch this show? Uh, I would love for people to come see this show because, similarly to what Barney and Amelia have said, it's a big family thing, pantomime. But I got into theatre when I was much younger and it was because of shows like pantomimes that I, I got interested. And it's what made me want to perform. And I think, you know, when you're at home and you're singing like with a hairbrush and things like that, or you know, you put Spotify on and you think no one's listening, you're just like rocking out and singing to the songs, and you think no one else can hear you. Everyone's doing that because we all kind of want to perform a little bit and pantomime is a great way to introduce young theatre goers to theatre and to live performance and to music and to like the bands and the costumes and the world of like lighting and everything like that. You never know who's going to be sat in the audience and who's going to go, I want to do that in that moment because of panto. So I, I, I think everyone should come and see it because you're gonna have a good time, you're gonna laugh, you're gonna love the songs, you're gonna love the staging, the costumes are brilliant, but you might just realise that you want to do something like it yourself, and yeah. it could be the start of a whole new adventure. I do. I'll put it there. That's a new one. Oh, right. Hang on. Oh, um, uh, I knew that. Yeah. I, I totally knew that. I knew it, I knew it, I did. I've got, it's, it's all in there. It's in there the entire time, I think. What's going on? They're a bit weird these two, aren't they? Just a little bit. <laughs> Thanks very much, that's awesome. Wow, can you buy me one? I'd like a pony. I want a pony. Oh, let's be pony twins. Yeah. It's happening. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>